Hi. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to. Uh, I forgot the name. Who's <laughs> <laughs> back? He doesn't have the brain for that. Rip. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Three fools, one brain cell. My mind went completely blank right there. I'm like, <clears throat> what, what are we calling this again? <laughs> Two pennies and a nickel. <laughs> Who's the nickel? Whoever has the brain cell. Well, it definitely wasn't me right then, <laughs> obviously. Alrighty. Well. This weekend, uh, in this, it, actually, this weekend football was pretty crazy, wasn't it? With the losses and the wins. How was that? Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there were some pretty, pretty high scoring games and some pretty fucking unbelievable wins. Yeah, two of them were great. <laughs> I love games were pretty neck and neck. I mean, we got our we got our like super. There, there were some blowouts, but we got what? We had our Super Bowl matchup early. Yeah, that's not true. Who was it? Uh, Ravens 49ers. Wow. I hope not. I don't want. I think it's gonna be. I I really think it's going to be the Dolphins and the 49ers, but... Could be very wrong. The Ravens have a habit of choking in the playoffs, so... That they do. And... Browns put a beating on somebody. Who was it? Who the heck did the... Oh, the Jets. Made them look like they were just a high school team. <laughs> oh, aren't they? <laughs> Basically. <laughs> Bringing, uh, Joe Flacco's doing pretty well. Went from watching football on TV to playing it and going into the playoffs. Wait, did you say the Browns and the Jets? Yeah. Wasn't that Thursday night's game? Uh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I was looking up ahead in the week. Wow. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute there, pal. I was like, I could have been wrong, I guess, but I thought it was pretty right. <laughs> <clears throat> we had Patriots versus the Broncos. And the Broncos Dang. lost in glorious fashion. I think As Russell Wilson tradition? got sat too. I, actually, he's benched. I don't think he's playing this week. Uh, dude, I saw this meme earlier today, and it was a shot of the OJ, a uh, low speed chase in LA. Oh god! But it was Russell Wilson instead of OJ. <laughs> <laughs> it was like Russell Wilson running away with his 150 mil on two losses, <laughs> or two loss season. Yeah. What makes them losing better is it's to the Patriots and it potentially has knocked them out of getting into the playoffs. Mm-hmm. We may not be in the playoffs, but we still affect it. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck am I looking for here? Oh, it's Chargers mm -hmm. Broncos. I really dislike like, that the name. What the hell My homie is, my homie is just. They even had their good luck charm making there and it me didn't help. Him. Making me hate him even more. Is it just me or does he like, after every play look very winded? It's all that fucking cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> it's finally catching up with him. Yeah, it is. So, Wrath, what, what were the scores and stuff this week? Or is he not ready for that? 
RC I'm not even there. Ready. I'm always <laughs> here. That's right. Isn't there a chance that it kind of goes like that? <laughs> All right. It was week 16, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. right. Well, we got the Rams over the Saints, 32-22. Um, we got the Steelers over the Bengals, 34-11. to Bills over the Chargers, 24-22. The Jets over the Washington, 30 30 to 28. Holy, you're flying through this. Yeah, I will, I'm sorry. Am I going too fast? You ain't even touching our picks, dog. Wait, what? Oh. It's, uh, there's always an issue. <laughs> <laughs> you can never do it right the first time. You can never God. do it right the first time. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh wow, the Bills Chargers game really close. Yeah. Why? Because dude, the Chargers had to fucking show out, dude. <laughs> Get their coach fired and show they can actually play. <laughs> <laughs> like, man, if we really want Billichek, we gotta prove ourselves. <laughs> I don't think right, Billichek's did I going anywhere. Up the pick list? Oh. Why? Oh, I know why this isn't lining up. Um, no, I don't know why this isn't lining up. Hold on. I don't know. Uh, um, yeah, we can see you again. Can't be. No, oh. I think I messed. I think I missed it. Actually. Oh well, well I'll, I'll go over these. Uh, so the first game was an afternoon game between the Saints and the Rams. It ended twenty-two to thirty. And it was no surprise that the Rams won. Let's see team stats. The Saints got 339 yard total yards versus the Rams 458 yards. Passing yards 304 to 325 passing yards. Holy crap. Joe, the reason why it's not lining up is because week 16 starts in the 1516 tab. Okay, thank you. No problem. <laughs> <sighs> Sounds like Venom had to brain cell for a minute. Hey, it took some fucking digging, man. <laughs> <laughs> because I was sitting there going, wait a minute, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Ryan, what did you talk about? I was talking about the uh, the Saints and the Rams. I saw there was quite a quite a bit of passing yards. Three hundred and four and three hundred and twenty five. Who's the quarterback for the Saints? Is it Der is Derek Carr playing now? Or is he still sure, out? To be honest with you. Actually, I could, guess I could look at the player stats and it would tell me. Yeah, Derek Carr. Okay. 319 yards, three touchdowns, one interception. How many, wait, where's... Uh, hello, where are you? What a decent ground game, too. Why isn't... Oh, duh, that's why. Matthew Stafford was 24 for 34 yet. Yeah, 24 catches for... No. Yeah, 24 for 34 attempts. Jeez. With 328 passing yards and two touchdowns. Yeah. Did you say there was a lot on the ground? No, I uh, realized that... Uh... <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm I, like, I pass. Forget that that happened. <laughs> delete it from the record. I, I definitely Mistakes not. Were made. I'm not deleting. And it says 35 yards, rushing yards for uh, the Saints. I mean, no, for some reason I was looking at four the Rams got 100 and... yards, and I was looking at passing yards as rushing yards. I was. Rams got 133 rushing yards. What happened to Alvin Alvin Kamara? I thought he was good. Rushing Alvin Kamara. He only got he got 19. He had nine carries for 19 yards. What is his stats for the season? Camara stats. No, I want to. I want to season stats. There we go. Twenty twenty three season. He's on. He's at one hundred and seventy attempts with six hundred and forty nine yards, and five touchdowns. I feel like. I thought he was a way better running back than that. I guess 649 yards ain't terrible, but. Alright, well. More than what I got. Well, yeah. <laughs> oh, I it, it, it would be more than I would ever get. <laughs> no, that's a better way of putting it. Thank you. <laughs> Giants and the Eagles. That game was close. It yeah, was, and it was upsetting. <laughs> oh. 25 to 33. Wasn't it like down to the final drive with the Giants? I didn't catch the end of the game. Yeah. Um, I was on the road by that point. But, uh, oh my goodness. Somebody's getting a phone call. All right, boys. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it came down to the final drive, and the the Giants screwed it up at the end because they managed the clock terribly at the end. That's how they ended up losing that. But it was really surprising me watching that game. You wouldn't think so, though, with the total yards. <laughs> 292 total yards versus the Eagles, 430... 465 yards, 186 passing yards, and 106 rushing yards. To the Eagles, 296 passing yards, so 170 rushing yards. <coughs> Their quarterback probably got 90% of that. Oh, wait, no. I forgot. Like, right near the end, Dion Swift got a bunch of yards. I think it was at like 40 something yards and like right near the end of the game he ended up rushing for like another 20. Yeah, there were missed opportunities in that game on the Giants part. The Giants could have upset him. They could have. And it would have been glorious. It <laughs> would have been. It would have been so beautiful. They took uh, DeVito out. And put oh, they lost. T. Taylor in. Tony he, Taylor. He had. Devito had nine catches for sixteen attempts, and then Taylor had s seven catches for sixteen attempts, one hundred and thirty-three yards to Devito's fifty-five. No touchdowns, no interceptions, and Taylor got one touchdown and one interception. I just can't believe Tyrod Taylor is still relevant. <laughs> I mean, come on. Joe Flacco's even playing. You can't believe that? I mean, he's doing better than fucking Aaron Rodgers. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Is that difficult right now? You don't usually go to the Browns to rejuvenate your career. Usually you go... To the Browns to end your career. <laughs> 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 
you either go to them or the Jets, and he went to the Jets, and his <laughs> career should have ended, and it, it didn't. Not yet. So now they're going to have to erect a statue of Joe Flacco when he takes him to the Super Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> At least they're acknowledging that the Browns have a chance. Of course they have a chance. All teams in the playoff have a chance. <laughs> You're usually biased. All right, let's let's just. I don't have a team. Even in the playoffs. I, I know. What's that say about you? <laughs> it means I don't have a team in the playoffs. <laughs> Horrible taste in team. Nah. My team is the greatest dynasty in the history of the NFL. Fucking God. <laughs> they ain't there no more. It doesn't Preach. matter. It, it doesn't once, matter. Once, once, once they're on that stage and ruling it again, you can talk your shit. But, man, nah. that's done and passed. That was an era now in decay. All right? Nah. It's still, it's nah, still it's, there. It's a reconstruction phase. <laughs> They're gonna they're I gonna know, come and back and dominate another twenty years. Is a, a team down in five to ten years, You're playing mediocre at that. You just yeah, wait. We're, uh, we're what three into that five year span? Yeah, been to the playoffs once. Yeah, and that's... by the looks of it, you might need another ten. Nah. Wow. Come on, look at the, look at the team. This isn't, this isn't the Lions we're talking about here. <laughs> Isn't Damn, the cowgirls man. we're talking about here? Damn, shit! I can't even argue those facts. <laughs> <Two statements>. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the Patriots used to be the Lions. They used this to is the up. Galactic <laughs> Empire. <laughs> the Galactic Empire. Holy! Don't right, worry, get we're, we're getting ready to bring peace and justice to the fucking NFL. All right, yeah, fuck that shit. All right, let me get these picks and uh, scores out of the way real quick, and then you guys continue down your freaking delusions, all right? They're not delusions. <laughs> they're not delusions. They're hallucinations. <laughs> get it right. All right, so we're starting back from the top real quick because I don't know where the hell we left off. Rams beat the Saints 30-22. Um, Weymouth and... Jordan I didn't pick had... anything this week, I don't think. Uh, no, these, these ones you did because... These oh. ones happened before the last recording. Ah, uh, gotcha. These ones um, happened before you died. <laughs> Weymouth and uh, Venom picked the Ravens. I picked the Jags. Wait, hold on. I'm looking at the wrong game. Oh, where am I looking? <laughs> Saints Rams. There it is. <laughs> um, all right. Weymouth and Venom picked the Rams. I picked the Saints. I took a big one. Yeah, you did. Um, Steelers beat the Bengals 34 to 11. Weymouth and Venom picked the Bengals. I took the W Steelers. Lucky. Look at that. Back and forth already. <laughs> uh, Bills beat the Chargers 24 to 22. Oh, yeah, I remember this pick. Weymouth and Venom had the Bills. I took an L with the Chargers. Yeah, I remember asking you what was wrong with you after they lost. 21 to 60 something. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with me. I wasn't playing. Uh, silence? Uh, yeah, because. <laughs> Don't you just love sharing an uncomfortable silence? <laughs> um. All right, then we got what? Jets beating Washington, thirty to twenty-eight. Venom had uh, the Jets. Wait, did I? Yeah, the Jets. Oh, we both had the Jets. We took a w yeah, on that. Why would you guys pick the Jets over Venom the Redskins? Had... I guess. It's the Jets every time, dude. This isn't the RG3 Washington Redskins that we know and love. Oh, yeah, yeah. This was the game that was uh, the stoppable force meets the uh, penetrable Movable force. Object. Yeah, that thing. 
got the Lions beating the Vikings uh, 30 to 24. Uh, then I'm on Vikings. I'm on Lions. I believe in the Lions. Uh, Browns beat the Texans 36 to 22. Venom had the Texans. I had the Browns. Yeah, Venom all got the damn Venom game win pick beat this week. I know, it's scary. But, right? Uh, I'm, I'm actually <laughs> surprised. Packers beat the Panthers 33-30. to 30. Wow, we both picked the Packers. I thought I actually picked the Panthers. I'm not going to lie. Why would you pick the Panthers? Just because they got one win? Oh, wait, never mind. Pardon me? No. No, no. But I'm just being stupid. No, I understand. I'm, I remember why I made my pick now. I forgot the Panthers <laughs> record there for a second. <laughs> um, Seahawks beat the Titans 20 to 17. We both had the Seahawks pick. Falcons beat the Colts 29 to 10. I think we. Didn't we, we both, both pick the Colts? the Colts? Wow. Oh, we both took an L on that. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, we Falcons didn't the Falcon it up. Uh, Buccaneers beat the Jaguars 30 to 12. Um, That's kind of a surprise. Ben had the Jags. I had the Bucks. I didn't expect the Buccaneers to beat the Jags. I would have gone with the Jags too. No. Dolphins beat the Cowboys 22 to 20. We both had the Dolphins pick for that one. As is tradition. <laughs> it, it was the right call, obviously. Surprisingly, <laughs> surprisingly, it was a close game. I honestly thought the Dolphins were going to destroy the Cowboys. I didn't think it was going to be a close game. Um, Bears beat the Cardinals 27 to 16. No surprise. Venom picked the Bears. I picked the Cardinals. I picked the L, then I picked the W. This is where Maybe. I start to catch up. <laughs> There's still not enough games. <laughs> the ratio's in my favor. <laughs> Patriots beat the Broncos 26 to 23. Venom had the Patriots picked, I had the Broncos. Venom Hell the yeah. W. Raiders mm -hmm. beat the Chiefs 20 to 14. Oh, you both went Raiders. We both went Raiders. Yeah, you listened to your boy for once. <laughs> yeah, I was already going with the Raiders. <laughs> there was nothing you said. <laughs> Eagles beat the Giants 32-25, so upsetting. Um, I, I'm pretty sure I picked the, the Giants. No, you picked the Eagles. Oh, no, I picked the Eagles. Oh, you picked the Giants. Wow, I'm surprised. Yeah. I was rooting, I was, dude, I was rooting against the Eagles the entire time. And I stand by it. Um, Ravens beat the 49ers 33 to 19, and if that is the Super Bowl game, uh, Super Bowl game, and uh, this is how the score is, that's just gonna be sad. What? Wait, what? What, what do you mean what? You said something about if that's gonna be the Super Bowl. Hey, the Bowl game could have been a hell of a lot better. But well, what game? Isn't this one of the possible outcomes for what one? being the Super Bowl? What one? Ravens and Niners. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. My God, you actually, I was about to say, dude, I'm done. <laughs> if I'm wrong on this, I'm just done. I'm not doing the show no more. Find someone else. You beat like, me by one pick. I beat you by one? There's just you no beat way. Me by, you beat me by one pick this week. <laughs> I had eight. I had eight right. You had nine, and then the Lions Cowboys game is is going on currently, and we both have the Lions pick for it. Yeah, but once again, honestly, look, looking, the score hasn't changed since the first quarter. No, <laughs> but I don't. I don't know what's all going on. Haven't the Lions game, been a but... second half team this this season? Oh, and I got you with the Browns stuff, too. But that's week 17. Pick. <laughs> yeah, you beat me by fucking one. <laughs> well, 
at least I did the impossible. All right, now what how moments do we want to talk about? I can um, talk about how the, how the Giants can't, you know, hold on to an interception that could have changed the outcome of the game. <laughs> was it in that game? It was that game. It, w it was very much that game. <laughs> See, that was... my sister's a freaking Eagles fan, too, which made it, made it, <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, I bet Beck was fucking happy about that game. Uh, that was just wrong setting. That game was. I, I, I just just. I don't get it. Why why it was even so close? Like this is why I don't think the Eagles are making the Super Bowl. Just because of how badly they played against a bad team. That and I. I hate that their quarterback decides to run more than using like their running back to run. <laughs> I really don't like the mobile quarterback thing. I wish it would go away. I miss pocket passers. But unfortunately, I don't think they're going to they're going to go away. I think more and more teams are going to get them. You would have it, mobile quarterbacks have been around for a while. We'll, we'll see. I miss, miss, miss slots. Not as much as it's been now. It just seems like now quarterbacks rather hold the ball and run. I mean, <clears throat> fucking Mike Vick, he's the one that started it. You go back in time and take him out, you can get your pocket passes back. I will. I'm gonna go and take him out. <laughs> you just gotta. <laughs> you just gotta. Uh, get well, up with that. Another reason I hate the Eagles. I'm gonna go. Eagles? Oh yeah. Wait. Was he drafted? He wasn't drafted by the Eagles. It was the Falcons that drafted him, wasn't it? Yeah, he was a Falcons player. Thought so. Oh shit! Do I have the wrong bird? <laughs> <laughs> I know who we're talking about. I promise that much. <laughs> He did go to the Eagles, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he, I think he ended with the Eagles. Yeah. Yeah, then my comment stands. Either, either the Eagles or the Panthers. It was a weird fucking team. Yeah. Can we get it to the ground now and see what's going on? Was he on the Eagles when he got caught dogfighting? Yep. Yeah. See, that's, see, that's what I thought. <laughs> um. That was my main excuse for him. Oh my god. Let's see. Oh no. So he was with the e or the Falcons from 01 to 08, the Eagles from 09 to 2013, then he went to the Jets. He went to the Jets? Yeah. And I then he played for the Steelers in 2015. I really don't remember that. Oh, him playing for the either. Jets or going to the Steelers at all. I don't either. But, okay, apparently I can't argue with Google, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could, but I won't win. Holy, that Lions and Cowboys game is really low scoring. Like I said, that score hasn't changed since the first quarter. And that was the beginning of the first quarter that they both uh, put a point. Halftime, three to seven. The Lions could win if but, they come but, out. But you know, if you look back, you know, at the games last week, the Lions actually had a good showing. And honestly, even though that the Cowboys lost to the Dolphins, they only lost to the Dolphins by two. They lost by a safety. Yeah, but it's much. this close for a Cowboys well, home saying, game. I think both teams are just put. I think they're putting it on, bro. All on the <laughs> line, cause the Cowboys still has a playoff chance, don't they? Yes, I think they're both in the playoffs. Like a wild card, at least. Yeah. Yes. Oh no! Yeah, clinch wild. Co uh, Cowboys already clinched the wild card. Yeah. Yeah. So did the, and the Lions. They. 
they claim division. Yeah, so they're in. A, they're both. I'm. Actually, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, starters aren't playing. Nope, they are. Jared Goff is playing and Dak, Dak Prescott. Well, I guess the Cowboys would be trying to play for home field advantage. Yeah, that's true. And I don't think I'm surprised Jared Goff is playing because I don't think the Lions can even get home field advantage at home, but. Maybe they could. Well, I actually they have a better record than the Cowboys. Holy! <laughs> the Lions. Yeah, they got an eleven and yeah. four record. Or the, yeah. Yeah. So maybe they are both playing for home field advantage. That's why they're both playing. Their starters. Good old Slack Prescott. <laughs> Cowboys are Dolphins beating them in total yardage. Going to be a good game. Yeah. Which one? Dolphins Ravens. As long as yeah. those Ravens actually, you know, say, "Hey, let's actually just make sure we don't fuck up this week." <laughs> let's bring it our all. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Go team. Go. <laughs> you know, it'll be a good game. Anybody see uh, what uh, Lamar Jackson get knocked down by the ref? Yeah. <laughs> The Higgin rep was backpedaling into the end zone and it pretty much knocked down, uh, made Lamar, Lamar slow up enough, but get hit at the same time and then throw the ball, which it ended up being like intentional grounding, which made a safety. I was like, yep, they're going to lose this game now. It so. was funny too, because it was like the only, I saw a meme about it. <laughs> It was like the only person that could stop Lamar Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> I think he would have gotten tackled anyway, but I don't think the ref really, in being in the way, really screwed any of that up. Because I think whoever was chasing was like hot on his heels. Mm. If I remember right. Did the Ravens like open up? Like, well, yeah, they did. They scored 17 points in the third quarter. They didn't score anything in the last quarter. Oh, yeah, Brock Purdy had a terrible game. Threw four interceptions. Wow. Lamar Jackson didn't throw nothing. Did they sit Brock Purdy? Oh, they must have at the end. Yeah, because there was a total of five interceptions. Yeah. Darnold. S. Darnold. McCaffrey went for over 100 yards. That's not a surprise. <laughs> the, uh, the Panthers are shooting themselves in the foot letting that guy go. Pretty sure that's what it was. Who? McCaffrey. Yeah. They might actually, you know, have a halfway decent record. It's all right. They'll, they'll get them another one in the draft. <laughs> Maybe. My child is mad. <laughs> Third quarter, starting up with the Lions and the Cowboys. Honestly, I, th I think for this week, other than, well, Browns already played on Thursday. You got the Lions and the Cowboys, the Cowboys now. Playing now. The only other game that I'm looking forward to this week is the Dolphins-Ravens. Yeah. That and I'm always looking forward to the Patriots games. Yep. That and the Raiders. <laughs> the Ra yeah, if the Raiders I don't, don't sign their interim head coach right now as a full-time head coach, they're they're idiots. 
and deserve to continue to lose. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they literally got the best coach they could get right now, and they'll probably fuck it up. They'll More go sign. Likely. They'll go sign somebody else. <laughs> The guy what they'll who's... do is they'll, they'll hold out hope until the last minute that <laughs> fucking they can pick up Belichick. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> and then fucking he's gonna back out. They're gonna lose their head coach that they got now. I I wouldn't be surprised. It'd be a very Raider thing to do. Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, it's almost as bad as moving a fucking traditionally California-based team to Nevada. <laughs> well, you know. Like, I can understand going from from the Bay Area to Los Angeles. I can even understand going back to the Bay Area. <laughs> but then, instead of moving them back to Los Angeles... They're like, ah, fuck it, we're gonna take them four hours east into the middle of the fucking desert where we test all of our fucking shiny new shit. <laughs> I, I don't... I think it was a bad move. Well, you know. It was their move to make, though. Yeah. We're talking about the, the Raiders, aren't we? Shit sports teams other than the Kings. Didn't they also buy the uh, Athletics? Who? Uh, Las Vegas. Like, didn't Las Vegas get, like, pretty much all of Oakland's teams? I think so. Yeah, I don't think Oakland has any teams anymore. I don't blame anybody for leaving Oakland. <laughs> I would. Wasn't their stadium falling apart? Yeah. And the town didn't want to pay for a new stadium, which I don't blame the town. I don't think a town should have to pay for a billionaire to have a new stadium. But yeah. That, that's just me. <laughs> you bought a team, you should be able to uh, afford to rebuild your Especially stadium. For what they were charging for tickets and shit, too. Yeah. Did their owner finally croak that old man, or did he sell so. the team? Yeah, I think he's dead. Uh, I can't remember his name. I can't either, but he was like... I always remember... There was a, I think it was a 30 for 30 episode about the Raiders. And I watched it. Every night for like, oh shit, wasn't it Al Davis? Like a month straight, and he was always wearing this fucking Leatherman jacket or Letterman jacket. Yeah, Al Davis. For the Raiders. He's dead. He died in 2011. <laughs> yeah. Holy, he was born in 1929. Yep. I think his son has the team now. In Brockton, Mass. Died in Hilton, Oakland. And the current owner for... Oh, yeah, the current owner is on Raiders. 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 Yeah, but Mark he always... His, his old... His like, son looks dad. like a guy... I, he looked... Oh my god. His son looks creepy. Yeah. <laughs> He's got Al a bowl okay, haircut. What the heck? Al Davis reminds me of a used car salesman. <laughs> Probably. Mark Davis just looks like a fucking... Pedophile? Pedophile with Down Syndrome. <laughs> <laughs> He's 68 years old. Oh, there's, oh, nope, I can't watch this video.
No, stop that. He's the GM for the Raiders and the owner of the Las Vegas Aces. And he's won a WNBA championship. Wow. Why Raiders? Who cares? Why Raiders owner won't Mark Davis will not sign Antonio? Because he's Brown? dumb. I no, I think that's the head coach. His name's Antonio. I'm pretty sure. Head coach. Yeah, Antonio Pierce is the head coach right now. The interim head coach. I really would not be surprised if they didn't. He went to another team and took him to the Super Bowl. <laughs> I would laugh. Yeah. Just like if the Patriots get rid of uh, Bill Belichick and he goes to another team and goes to the Super Bowl. <laughs> I don't think he's going anywhere, but... Everyone is, seems quite convinced that he's leaving the Patriots. Yeah. Everyone else has the same thing going with that. Different teams, though. Everyone's got a different different team that they're spending now. I've heard multiple different teams. I've heard Cowboys. I've heard Chargers. I've heard... So, we were talking Giants. about Antonio. And I thought we were talking about Antonio Brown. Right, yeah, Antonio Pierce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. so I googled Antonio Brown just to see what what's been going on with him since he had his freak out. I think he uh. He, wants he to just go to the posted Chiefs. on Twitter. He just posted on Twitter or X. Uh, about a minute ago, road dome so sloppy I almost crashed the whippopotamus. What? <laughs> Something is not right with this <laughs> man, boys. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Antonio Brown calls out Sean Payton after Broncos bench Russell Wilson. This is how the Crackers blame it all on you. Oh, <laughs> uh, he needs help, man. Yeah. Hey, at least he got that Super Bowl. Yeah. Super Bowl win. <laughs> with Whitey. And then he could he could have had a very good chance of getting to another one but decided to walk off the field. Yeah. <laughs> but whatever. Guess it's his life, he can live it how he wants. If he wants to live it nah, crazy. Dude, it's simulation. We're all just NPCs in it. <laughs> this man's delusional. <laughs> Terminator's gonna get us. The Terminator. Yeah, yeah not the Terminator. Yeah, that, 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 Elon that, that's Musk. Conspiracy theory. I believe it. Never mind. <laughs> 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 nah, the Terminator ain't ain't what you gotta worry about, man. It's Elon Musk. He's gonna awaken some shit on Mars that we can't put to sleep. <laughs> so what's gonna be the upset this weekend? For, the upset yeah, what team's gonna weekend. what team's gonna upset the Bengals are gonna upset the Chiefs? Huh? The Bengals are gonna beat the Chiefs. I actually do have the Bengals beating the Chiefs. I think it's more of a hopeful that they beat the Chiefs, but. Oh really? Oh, you the Patriots Bills the game. Patriots? The Patriots Bills game is gonna be anyone's. I think it's gonna be anyone's game. <laughs> no, they, they they won't cross that threshold. They'll keep the score as close as anything. The Pats will not take that win. They, they, they'll they're gonna it. they're gonna take it. No, they're gonna refuse it. They Why? have no reason to take the win. Yeah, they do. To screw the Bills up. <laughs> okay, nope. screw the Bills up, but it also screws up their pick. Why is everybody so worried about the pick? They're still going to have a top pick either way. It doesn't matter. Yeah. And it's already screwed up. So it doesn't matter. Because there's no way the Panthers are getting another win this season. And there's no way the Cardinals are getting another win this season. All right. 
Patriots will lose by one possession, by at least by by three to seven points. That's what that, that's what the point the score difference is going to be if it's if it's a good game. Nah, I think the Patriots Shit. are going to win. Patriots are winning by a fucking touchdown. <laughs> Old Zappy's going to come in and just throw dots left and right. <laughs> It would be pretty hilarious to see the uh, Cardinals beat the Eagles. Oh, that would be disgusting. <laughs> I am okay with that 100%. I think I actually picked the Eagles, though, to be honest. I mean, you, you, yeah, why I wouldn't we you? All the Eagles. <laughs> I can acknowledge that, yes. They're not a team that's just going to lose to anybody. I still want them to lose. <laughs> lose already. I mean, it's not outside the, uh, the realm of possibility. <laughs> I've seen really good teams get real cocky and just get beat yeah. by a team that completely sucks. Vikings Packers game would be good, though. I'll have to say that. That'd be a good game for, uh, NFC North. I was gonna say just because it's a divisional game. Yeah, I, I honestly I just think it's gonna be a good game. I think that'll be a, another close game, not a high score game, but a close game. <laughs> the Lions got the uh, the ball in the Dallas twenty one. <laughs> Did you just whisper go? <laughs> <laughs> no, don't 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 let the Cowboys know. Please, yeah. <laughs> Against them. <laughs> Can't root yes. against your team. Yes, let the hate flow through. <laughs> Fucking tells the team I believe in humanity. <laughs> oh, you got anything else to talk about this week, or? Oh yeah. Well, what are we going to talk about? Uh, into the world of the NBA. Oh, yeah, I forgot that exists. <laughs> <laughs> um, the Detroit Pistons have now set the league record for most consecutive losses in a season. Didn't they almost lose? 27 or win? in a row. 27 losses in a fucking row. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't they almost beat the... Uh... Celtics? That's who they played, wasn't it? Uh, they played the Raptors yesterday and finally won. Oh. Yeah. Like, that's... That's grounds for sending your team to another state. <laughs> huh? Um... Magic are still number four <clears throat> right now. Um, they don't play until tomorrow night. They play the they play the Suns and the Celtics play the Spurs. Uh, oh, there must have been but, a flag uh, flag during the Lions Cowboys game. It's second to four now. Oh wait, never mind. That was a that makes the first time. Sorry, continue. <laughs> You're good. Uh, Celtics are still number one in the Eastern Conference, twenty-five and six. Uh, Bucks are second with twenty-four and eight. Seventy-sixers are twenty-two and nine, and then you got the Magic at nineteen and twelve. Uh, in the Western Conference, you got the Timberwolves at twenty-three and seven. Uh, Oklahoma City at twenty-one and nine. Nuggets at third with 23 and 11. Clippers at four with 19, 12. Um, that's about it in the world of basketball for me. Unless you fellers got anything to add. I don't. I didn't, wa I, did I didn't watch any basketball and I... Honestly, I couldn't re hardly remember anything that happened in the NFL season. Or the NFL week, <laughs> so... 
the holidays the really got today. me screwed up. For sure. Yeah. Roll the hockey today. Uh, Jets beat the Wild 4-2. Sabres beat the Blue Jackets 3-2. <clears throat> Penguins beat the Blues 4-2. Canes beat the Leafs 3-2. Panthers beat the Canadians 4-1. Bruins beat the Devils 5-2. Pretty sure I got pretty close to calling that game dead on. I guess it was 4-1 last week. Uh, Rangers beat the Lightning 5-1. Preds beat the Capitals today 3-2. And then we got one more game tonight at 10. Uh, Oilers and Kings. Uh, Bron or, uh, Bruins play again tomorrow at 5 against Detroit. It'll be a good game. I haven't really seen anything crazy come out of the world of hockey recently. Uh, the bowl games this week were pretty high scoring, and there were a couple upsets, too. About the bowl games. <laughs> um, let's see. <coughs> I think last we talked, the coastal game was going on or getting ready to go on. Um, so Bowling Green lost to Minnesota, uh, 30 24. Texas State beat Rice, 45 21. Kansas beat uh, UNLV, 49 36. Virginia Tech beat Tulane 41-20. Uh, University of North Carolina lost to West Virginia 30-10. Um, to 10. Uh, USC beat Louisville 42-28. What the? In the Texas Bowl, Oklahoma beat Texas A&M 31-23. Uh, Boston College beat SMU 23-14. Rutgers University beat University of Miami 31-24 in the pinstripe bowl. I was not expecting that. <clears throat> Is this the last week of college football? Or yeah. college football be over tomorrow? Oh, are they going to start or getting not, ready not for... tomorrow, sorry, Monday. Monday's the last day of college football. Jeez. Uh... They're going to have to go back to their normal, boring school lives <laughs> until the combine. <laughs> yep. Um, NC State lost to Kansas State 28-19. <laughs> uh, Arizona beat Oklahoma 38-24. Clemson beat Kentucky 38-35 in the Gator Bowl. Notre Dame beat Oregon State 40-8 to in the Sun Bowl yesterday. Uh, Memphis beat Iowa State 36-26. Who comes up with these bowl names? Um, whoever pays the most money. <laughs> so, there, I was talking about this last week with Joe. So, like, uh, the Peach Bowl, the Orange Bowl, uh, the Citrus Bowl, which is now the Cheez-It Citrus Bowl, the Rose Bowl, and the Sugar Bowl were all, like, the major... <laughs> bowl games and now you got like the military bowl and the guaranteed rate bowl and it, it's literally like whoever can pay the most money to get their name in a bowl game it's just advertising at this point oh. so you're saying if I had enough money I could have a bowl named after me yeah I need money a lot of it, though, are, like, <laughs> towns and financing companies. And then, like, occasionally you'll get, like, a snack brand. Like, there was the Pop-Tart Bowl. The Pop-Tart Bowl? Yeah, I'm not dude. joking. That, it was NC State and Kansas State. Yeah. <laughs> um, but you have, like, the First Responder Bowl, the Military Bowl, um, Duke's Mayo Bowl. The Texas Bowl. Arizona uh, Bowl. Yep. Gator Bowl, Alamo Bowl. Uh, remember the Alamo. I, I think 
the Cotton Bowl Classic has always been a thing, but I can't remember. Um, but that was Missouri and Ohio State. Um, uh, and Missouri beat Ohio State fourteen to three. Um, in the Peach Bowl, you had Mississippi over Penn State thirty eight twenty five. In the Music City Bowl, you had Auburn losing to Maryland thirty one to thirteen. Orange Bowl, complete blowout. Georgia wiped the fucking floor with Florida State. I think you called that too, didn't you? Yeah. I said it was going to be a close game. You were like, nah. Nah, dude. Georgia wasn't fucking around. <laughs> well, you had Florida State is pushing whatever. I can't remember what what division Georgia's in for the life of me. Um, but... Hold on, let's see. They're in the SEC. So, uh, Florida State is in the ACC. Or, no, 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 sorry. The AAC, right? No, they're in the ACC. Oh, so Lions scored. Florida State has... Filed the petition to be removed from the ACC, and they want to become a part of the SEC. That was Georgia's way of saying you're not welcome here, and you need to get the fuck out of here, thinking you're worth something. <laughs> um, I think Georgia, by the end of the first quarter, had their third string players in. Uh, and Florida State still had their starters in until the end of the game, if I remember correctly. <laughs> I mean, that's the different caliber of football program. Yeah. You know? Um, but that was in the Orange Bowl. In the Arizona Bowl today, you had Wyoming against Toledo. Wyoming won 16-15. <laughs> and then... Um, <laughs> Your New Year's Day games for all of you that are going to be hungover. Uh, you have the Relia Quest Bowl, Wisconsin and LSU. You got the Fiesta Bowl and Liberty University in Oregon. The Cheez It Bowl with Iowa and Tennessee. The Rose Bowl with uh, Alabama and Michigan, which that's going to be a great fucking game. Uh, and then you have the Sugar Bowl. <clears throat> Sugar Bowl. That's going to be Texas and Washington. And I think that's going to be a great game too. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to the Sugar Bowl, and I'm also looking forward to the Rose Bowl. The Rose Bowl is going to be fucking great. Um, both teams want it. They want it bad. <laughs> I think Wisconsin LSU might be a decent game. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Wisconsin, Wisconsin historically has always had a great fucking football program. Uh, same goes for LSU. So it'll be it'll be interesting to say the least. And uh, I think we talked about the upcoming fights too last week for January thirteenth, so that'll be that'll be a good watch. <clears throat> Anybody gonna get busted open? Uh, I'm I'm sure. <laughs> uh, the main event: Magomed Inkalev against Johnny Walker. That's that's going to be a great game or a great game, great great game. fight. <laughs> good game. Good game. <laughs> it's like he's on top of him hammer fist. Yeah. Good game. Good game. <laughs> um But yeah, I think I think that'll be a good fight. And then the 
Ricky Simone and Mario Batista fight would probably be pretty good too. Batista? Yeah. And then, dude, the, the prelims are... F My thing recently, like, yeah, the the main card fights are usually super hyped up, but they're over either in the first round or they go to decision. Yeah. Like, recently. Most of the prelim fights have been super fucking entertaining. <laughs> You got one dude. You got one dude who's a welterweight. He's eleven and uh, eleven six and zero. Oh. His name is Matthew Semmelsberger, <laughs> and he just looks like a. Jesus. Are all these pay per view fights? Hello? Are the closures on? I think so. Is he following me through the hole? I think he might have. <laughs> um, hello? <laughs> well, uh, yeah. <laughs> Give the outro. <laughs> do the outro or. Alright. You don't want to do quick? Oh shit. Yeah, I guess we I guess we do gotta do that, huh? Has Venom made his picks? Cause it's like yes, he has. I think he's gone. I think he'll show back up here. Uh, I'll go I'll start going through. He's got his picks done already. Alright. For the Titan Texans. Um Weymouth and I are going Texans as Venom is going Titans. Falcons Bears. Weymouth and Venom are going Bears. Oh wait, no, we're all going Bears. Yeah, everyone's going Bears. Dolphins Ravens. Weymouth and I are going uh, Dolphins. I think the Ravens are going to screw Ravens. that up. Oh, he's back. Oh, he's back. Sorry about that. My internet died. We thought so. We're just going to um, the you guys, now. Uh, I was going to ask if you guys saw anything crazy in the world of sports, no. like news-wise. No. no. Nothing that's too standing, outstanding, I guess. That's Other than what I've already said with Russell Wilson being benched. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, Saints Bucks. Am I the only one that went Saints? No, you did. No, yeah, I went Saints as well. Both of us went Saints as Venom went a buck. Patriots, Bills. You both went the Patriots. I went the Bills. I'm calling it. It'll be a one possession uh, win. Bills over Pats. Now, you wrong. Eagles versus Cardinals. We're all Eagles. Panthers, Jags. But would be hilarious if we're all wrong and the Cardinals win. <laughs> Not, it, it's possible. Nothing's out of the realm of possibility. <laughs> Panthers, Jags, uh, Venom went Panthers as Venom Why? went Jags. Huh? Why? Why what? Why did he go Panthers? Why does he think the Panthers because, are going to Because oh, fuck oh. Trevor Lawrence, dude. <laughs> I'm oh. tired of that long-haired prissy fuck. <laughs> Trevor, if you're hearing this, I hope your fucking ankle breaks. <laughs> Man, you're mad at him. <laughs> what did he ever do to you? It's it's like he stole his cookie or something. <laughs> Raiders, Colts, we all want Raiders. Um, Rams, Giants. Weymouth went Rams. Venom and I went Giants. Why? Why? Because Rams are a better team than the Giants. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Niners, Washington. We all went Niners. 
I wouldn't be surprised if that became an upset, though. I would. Steelers, Seahawks. Huh? It's for the Niners, dude. Steelers, Seahawks. Uh, Venom and I went Steelers. Edge Ravens went Seahawks. Bengals, Chiefs. Weymouth and Venom went Bengals because I went Chiefs. Yeah, I think I'm Chiefs. Chargers, Broncos. Weymouth and Venom went Chargers because I went Broncos. Don't ask me why. Packers, um, Vikings. Because the Chargers have something to prove. No, I'm saying don't ask me why I went with Broncos. Who knows, dude? You don't even know why you went with the Broncos. I don't. <laughs> but it's okay. I don't remember. I don't remember why I made that decision, but I made it. I know I made it. Um, Packers. Did Vikings. you make it under duress? It's possible. <laughs> Was Russell Wilson holding a gun to your head, man? Okay, you can tell us. Blink twice if you're in danger. Yeah, but Russell Wilson's getting benched, so. Yeah, but it's still his team, man. Yeah. Packers, Vikings, Weymouth, and I went in Packers as Venom went Vikings. In any, in, in that could be anything, to be honest, in my opinion. Nope, it's going to be the Vikings by 14. I'd rather see the Vikings, Vikings win. by 14. Fuck the pack. Are you changing your pick? Is that what you just said? No, I'm not changing my pick, but I'd rather see the Vikings oh. win. 10-10 at the end of the third quarter for the Lions-Cowboys game. Yeah. Ooh. It's getting spicy. Alright, and that's all I got for picks. Oh, fucking beautiful. That would be, that was three fools and one brain cells. Leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe for more. Don't be an Antonio Brown.